back in the Grand Canyon. So anyway, we got an awesome trip ahead, 10 days, and you could pretty much almost see our whole route from Lippin Point. Um, it's a really big giant loop that I put together utilizing some pack rafting from Cardenas. It's gonna be pretty exciting. A lot, of, a lot of places and terrain in the canyon that I've never seen. So looking forward to it. Get this puppy started. Here we go, Grand Canyon 2024. No easy days out here. None. And then it spit me around and we were going backward right here and it was everything we could do when you go off trail there's always predicaments you get yourself into and you know we'll stop and we'll talk them through and we make a decision it may not be the right decision <laughs> this river is not easy today with the wind and the rain we're just going to deflate pack up again and hit the trail cheese and crackers, fresh apples. I think he's making some kind of salsa for the fish tacos. Awesome night. Uh, I'll never forget last night. I talked to my wife last night on the inReach and she reminded me that my daughter has a cheerleading contest on Sunday at Knott's Berry Farm. So kind of changed the dynamic of the whole thing. I really don't want to miss it. Basically got to be out of here and 
three more days. Um, I think we're about 20, 25 miles from the trailhead. I'm about to throw in the towel. I'm so done now. I don't even know what to do anymore. It's a whole different set of rules when you're doing off trail in the Grand Canyon as opposed to the Sierra. What makes a trip like this really hard is it's easy walking on trail. You know, you don't really have to think about where you're going. You just follow this nice trail. But when we do this off trail uh routes that we've been choosing man you got to be in focus mode uh pay attention where you're going but also where you're stepping this this stuff you could easily roll an ankle you could fall and break a leg yeah you can this these rocks are just razor sharp with one stone i mean i got pokes and pricks all over me it could be a vicious terrain man if it wants to rear its ugly head it's like everything is fighting against me to get out of here in time So done. I pretty much had a breakdown. I'm just. I know why you wanna hate me. I know why you wanna hate me. I know why you wanna hate me. Cause hate is all the world has even seen lately. I know why you wanna hate me. I know why you wanna hate me. Now I know why you wanna hate me. Cause hate is all the world has even seen lately. <laughs> I've officially lost it, dude. <laughs> oh man. She wins. One of the toughest days I've ever had mentally. It broke me for a minute. But what do you do if you're out here in the middle of the canyon? You gotta find the courage to get back up and just keep trucking. Just keep going. The desert's trying to grab you and poke you and deter you from venturing forward. But we say, F it, forward we go. Yeah. Arr. Arr. As you can tell by the color, we have made it to the little Colorado, baby. Far cry from yesterday. <laughs> it's amazing what these heights do. Such extreme ups and downs. I was at my lowest low yesterday and I was probably at one of the highest highs just the night before with the boating crew and the dinner and everything. And now I'm right back up close to that again. With this. That is one heck of a beautiful shot right there. Grand Canyon does not get much better than that right there. The color of this water, one of the best scenes in the Grand Canyon I've ever seen. We found this cairn and uh, that's our way down. That is steep. Look at that view though. That's gonna be a long drop all the way down to that creek bed. All right, I'm not gonna lie, I'm a little uh, puckered with this drop. I know there's a ramp. It's just intimidating though when you've never done it and you don't know what's kind of over this next bank and what kind of climbing is involved or anything like that, so.
On trail in the Grand Canyon, it's brutal. Off trail in the Grand Canyon, whole another level of brutal. Being in the canyon, experiencing these new places and sites, and I always say it's worth it to get off trail, but it's tough. We got our asses handed to us a couple times. Just next time, let's have a little light day in between. You know. <laughs> Please. I thought I had planned light days, but Grand Ooh. Canyon had something else in store for us on this route, brother. Exactly. Sorry. <laughs> she, she gets her way every time, too. Yep. <laughs>